Okay. Let's let us get into this. Hey everybody. Welcome back. The, the big city area is called dinners instead of like dinner I wonder if dinners is supposed to uh, sound like an actual city name I can't think of right now but yeah hey blaze and sleepy and Joe the last time we hit up the uh, Southwest corner of the island. So, um, we're trying to do all the corners, so since we're closest to this one already, why don't we try to go this way? See, I feel like we can't go to the uh, top right corner of the map, because that was the first corner I tried to go to last time. And I was having no luck. But since we're here, I'll check again. Right, because there's these rocks in the way. I could think to get here is if we came from the right. Waters. So. Oops. I'm gonna see if. I can approach from this side maybe somehow. No, you know what? This is that cave. Yeah, no, we, we definitely went through this way already. Yeah, you can swim in the paint. Uh... Maybe we could go up here because we couldn't come up here before. No, we've been up here as well. No, yeah, this is just completely blocked off. Yeah, because I've already been over here and I've already tried going north from here. And it just isn't happening, is it? So I don't think... You're probably supposed to do the northeast corner last. I'm guessing. Because this is the second time now we've uh, went all around... What is the one c screen connecting to the corner you haven't been to yet? None. <laughs> I've been all around. Because we've been to... Here's the corner. And we've been here and here. And it's both dead ends. So unless there's like a teleport tunnel or something. We're... We're not... Uh, I guess we're just not getting there until later. I don't know.
Not been to the one on the end. You mean here where it's all dead ends? Yeah, because there's no way to it. It's completely blocked. Or else, that's, I mean, that's literally what I was just doing over here. I was looking for a way. Yeah, blocked, 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 blocked. Fortunately. I mean, I'm looking at the edge. This is blocked, this is blocked, and this is blocked. And then from here, this is blocked, and this is blocked. There's a blank screen you could get to from below. I, I don't, I'm not sure what you're referring to. This is black, this is black. Now this is weird, because this looks like we haven't been here before, but this is how we get to dinners, I remember this. Yeah, you get to dinners from the south, so how the heck couldn't we have have gone through this area already? That's weird. That's almost like a Silent Hill thing or something where you went through and it like changes. Another lost kid. What the heck? What is this wander song? Held something or another, aren't you? You seem like a world weary traveler. How romantic. Me? Oh, I'm just a collector of things. I love weird knickknacks and discarded treasures. There's a certain magic to them, wouldn't you say? So tell me, on your travels, do you ever find discarded things like trash? I want them. I want them all. I'll trade you instruments and record players. Ooh. I want to, uh, Oh, so we have more use for trash, so it's a good thing I didn't spend it all at the plant place. It's a good thing I'm so stingy with currency when it comes to video games. Um... A double bass. Like it just says instrument. And then I will get a... Music player. It doesn't look... Am I just looking at that box right there? This looks like a little box. Why does that cost him? I'm assuming it's a record player though, so... Oh, now that's like a real record player. I feel like when you think of fighting games, you don't usually think of UFC, which is funny, because <laughs> that's like a fighting sport. Big city record, that would go perfectly on top of the, the rooftop party. Hello. Nice to meet you. Tell me, do you like music? Yep, I sure do. I knew it, me too, it's my favorite thing. I can already tell we'll be friends. Write a little song together. Okay. Yeah. Draw around me and I'll sing. I was doing that already.
Hey, you changed the last note, but okay. There you go, you did it right that time. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cool, it's a music note brush style. I said I actually said Wander Song earlier, but I didn't know it was made by the same people. Oh, that's why Dragnix likes this game so much. That explains everything. He doesn't like Chicory because of the that it's a it's a game that's good. He likes it because it's a Wander Song sequel. I should have known all this time. Brecky. I like how you tell me to use more colors as soon as I've changed my color. like a dog collar. I feel like that's insulting for a, a dog person. Oh, just kind of, I'm a dog person, I'm gonna wear a dog collar, huh? That's what you're trying to say? Wait, what the? Have I been here already? Why is this pre-colored in? I'm confused. So I don't want to go this way, I've already been here. Trash. More trash. Go this way. Monocle. What do we look like, Mr. Peanut? So we're gonna have to keep going east from here because this is also a dead end. Silly sword under the bridge is a red hot chili peppers song. Not a tactic in a video game. Oh, 
Hello. Talk to me. I was having a pretty rough week, but I always feel better when I'm with Yukama. Haha. Uh -huh. I don't really get it, but thanks. I'm just being me. Oh, wait, that's really all I need sometimes. Fine. Uh-oh. Okay, I thought I got stuck for a second. Everyone visits Brecky for the beach, but people who live here are kind of over it. That's why I'm always stoked when time comes to visit. It reminds me not to take it for granted. In the sound of the waves in J uh, I, want, I keep wanting to say Jamaica. Time is chill energy. Yeah, it's all, it always mellows me out. We should just move here, but then I'll get bored of the beach. Oh yeah. Hey, you better stay far away. So yeah, I think we just unlocked a new quick travel point. Oh, this is one happy pig. I was surprised to see all the color gone today. I think there's something beautiful about a blank world. Huge canvas for us to fill however we want again. Feels like a new beginning. Cantaloupe. That's probably the most positive response to the colors going away so far. Maybe that's some chicory you should hear. jumping from tree to tree that time. Oh, is this gonna be another thing we get to design? Cafe or bakery or something. You're Breakfast the Wielder, right? I'm, well, let's just say I run this sweet shop. Yes, let's just say that. Got time for a little side quest? Why did you say that so suspiciously? Wanna design an extra special sweet for me? Do I like cobras? I don't really have any experience with cobras. They have kind of a cool look to them, I guess. Want to design an... Yeah. I can create sweets in any shape at all. Make the most wild, delicious thing you can imagine on this plate. Uh-oh. Um... Okay, so the first thing that comes to mind is a cupcake. What if I just was lazy and I took a design idea from the last time I designed something? That's a, that's a head, and you had a brunch pizza? I feel like you'd be having a lot of pizza in, in Japan, which is not usually what I think of when I think of Japan. <laughs> what are my other styles like? We're gonna use our some of our stylings for evil. Oops. This is kind of this is kind of morbid. I was thinking of putting a flower on top, no joke. Um, I think I have an idea for that actually. I, I meant to do the spray effect, but how do I, it's not, experiment with that. Oh, this, there we go. Oh yeah, there we go. 
But uh, but then check this out. Here's how we're gonna do the flower. I have an idea. That we're going to um. some dirt and then the vine and flower oops I forgot to equip it <laughs> this is probably, like, unironically the best thing I've drawn in this game, and look at it, this is horrible. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, folks are gonna love this thing. Let me whip up a bunch, oh god. Oh, oh, they <laughs> surveyed it to people. Oh. oh no. What have I done? The scariest part is that it looks very human, the, the head, and they're all animals, so like, oh, this is what we do with humans, we eat them. What a treat for the senses, a delicious, sumptuous treat. In such an attractive and colorful shape, heck yes. I'll take 10. Oh, what have we done? Hello, fellow adult. After a busy day of eating grown-up vegetables, we, or I, am enjoying a tasty sweet. Very responsible and adult of me. And I am allowed to do this. As much as many times as I want. Because my mom doesn't make the rules anymore. Have a nice day. Oh. Curry. Just noticed her name was Curry. Dr. Cheese's research, you've got to meet her sometime. Her lab is just north of here. Okay. No. You go ahead and keep that recipe. Oh, they're advertising it! Oh. I better get going before, uh... <laughs> they start investigating this restaurant. There's my biggest fan. Ah, oh, hi. I don't know how to say this. I have something to show you. Oh, what the? Wait a minute. That looks familiar. You recognize it? It's my version of your self-portrait. The one hanging in the wielder tower. Wait, that's hanging in the wielder tower? Oh, God. I really wanted to make something just like it. Of course, I couldn't use colors like you do, but... What do you think? Well, if anyone did fan art of me, I would love it. Thank you. Unless it was extremely insulting, in which case I would probably only like it. So glad you loved it. Uh, I want you to have it. Oh, thanks. If you actually hate it and don't want to hang it anywhere, that's okay. It means a lot that I gotta give it to you. Thank you for making wonderful art. Well, that's nice of you. Oyster. It's like a cactus otter. Been working on the sand castle all day. I don't even know why. Just got really into it. You like it? Yeah, that's cool. Thanks. Really want to be a pop singer. I'd been getting ready for a big audition. Some bad news came today. Seems like that's on hold. I don't know how to process it, and now I'm here building a sandcastle. Trying not to think about it. Well, a stranger comes along and talks to me, I guess. I know it's gonna be okay. I know I can try again. In theory, but it's hard to keep feeling that when all you have in front of you is rejection, I'm trying to stay positive. I just want that chance so bad. Sorry for dumping my life story on you. No problem, stranger. Alright, so maybe from here... Whoops. Maybe from here, we 
can finally reach that corner we've been trying to reach. This is starting to look familiar. Oh, yep, we must be in the right place. This chick free. I haven't formed yet. Hey, breakfast. This is going to be a tough trial for me, I think. For you, I'm the one doing the trial. What's the matter? This was the last one I did. The theme is master passing on to student, um, and it didn't go so great for me. It was the last time I ever spoke to Blackberry. Geez, that, that's soon into the transition. Hate to bring up my age old drama, but I'm sure that's why this place got so messed up. We're gonna have to face it together. Follow this river up to its source. Uh -oh. yeah, I guess we have to do it the old fashioned way. Which is swimming through paint through solid object rather than water, which is much more difficult, let me tell you. Oh, is that tree blocking me? Uh, but I need to go through that. Oh, I see. Um, it doesn't connect. So, what? Go down this way. so like foggy here it's hard to see what I'm doing oh gosh was that all just for a gift you got a mask oh what the heck it's a face mask with a all let's try it just since we're in a new area that's very timely. When did this game come out? Oh yeah, I guess it would have been during uh, the pandemic, right? Um, did I mention Kevin I'm always watching? I don't know if I ever told that to you guys, but I thought I should let you know. Sonic Frontiers did come out today. Uh, I watched my friend Dragon Extreme some of it. Oh, hang on, this is like a darkness that comes and goes, but... I'm not able to get through here, though. I'm confused about which direction I'm going. If this darkness like fills back up, we feel like we want to go this way, right? Or else, what's the point of making the darkness go away? I, it's just so hard for me to see anything right now. I wish all these clouds were in here. The clouds remind me of uh, a couple of Yoshi's Island moments, which is a good thing, but in terms of me like trying to f see where the heck I'm going, it's 
making things very difficult. I'm gonna try to come back up here again. Maybe that's what I need to do. Here again. I think we're okay. I think this is the right way though. Okay, I need to just get down. I mean, the color is not a pro the problem right now. The problem is I can't freaking see anything. Maybe I'm not supposed to go that way. Maybe that's. You know what? I bet you that area was just for the gift, wasn't it? But like the fact that it had that little section that would the darkness would come and go made me think I had to go through that way, so it mixed me up. Those rocks are just a general blockage point. I could have sworn my I could have sworn my eyes. Why not? Wow, I re I really could have sworn I swam up there last time. What? Oh no, I used this. I was about to say, how the heck did I do that? I hope this is the only area that's so obscured like this. Because I'm having a rough time. Okay, so if I can use this to come up here... I had to make that. There we go. Sorry, um, what's my favorite Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles series? Um, I had a VHS tape of the, the old cartoon, but it was only just that one tape. I didn't, like... It's kind of before my time, so it's not like I like really caught it on TV or anything like that. Um, so I actually remembered seeing like the early 2000s uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, like probably more than any of them. The end is just ahead breakfast. You'll have to face the corruption. One of those things only the brush can fight. Sorry. Just go on ahead when you're ready. Hickory, what exactly happened between you and Blackberry? Well, I was just trying my best, and Blackberry kept saying to use different colors, and that I wasn't using enough... To... I wasn't maintaining visual variety for my viewers. And she yelled at me. I'll tell you if you really want to know. I'd looked up to Blackberry basically my whole life. Training with her was a dream come true. 
I'd say we even became friends. I was so desperate to please her, but that meant I had to be perfect. Any sign of weakness could have been the end of my dream to wield. So I hid myself from her, always pretended to be fine, even with no one else to talk to. And I basically got away with it, until this trial, my very last one. Was I think I was right, I think I was supposed to do this trial last. Even though I was able to get to it, but it seemed like it was extra blocked off for a reason. Blackberry knew something was up. She just pretended not to, until she actually had to relinquish the brush. Here. That's when every everything came out. All her doubts about me. This was supposed to be a simple final step. But she suddenly, she was suddenly threatening to take the brush back. I felt so betrayed. After everything, after coming so close, it got very heated. She tried to pull the brush out of my hands. I fought back. That seems like Blackberry is the one who has a big problem here. If anything, geez. And then something grew here. It was the first time I'd seen the, these black trees. We haven't spoken since then. I ran away with the brush. I was sure I could keep it all under control. Sure it would never happen again. Guess we all know how that went. So that's how all of this started and how the stuff all grew here. It's all my fault. How's that your fault? That's horrible. It's not just you, Chicory. Things have come for me too. It's the brush. Maybe the brush is what made it real, but I wish I'd been stronger. I let all of this grow inside me. Seeing how corrupted it is here, it's like I'm surrounded by my own mistakes. That's not being fair to yourself. Blackberry should have been there for you. Nobody can be perfect. That shouldn't have come between you and being the wielder. I think Blackberry knew this could happen if someone unstable wielded the brush. It reaches into you and makes all this stuff real, good or bad. Maybe it wasn't fair to me, but, well, life wasn't fair to me. So, Blackberry's like the Chuck McGill of the game, gotcha. I can't function the way normal people do, and I just have to live with that. I probably shouldn't have been a wielder, ever. But you were a great wielder. Maybe if you'd had more support, this wouldn't have come from the brush. Blackberry made that impossible for you. I wish someone had been there for you, Chicory. Wow, there's a lot of uh, dialogue here. I wish things had been different too. I wish I didn't need help. I wanted to do it all myself like Blackberry did, but I let everyone down. Sorry, I'm, I'm not in a good place here. I know you're trying to help, and you're probably right that it wasn't all just my fault. But I don't think I can do this right now. Just go on ahead. Okay. Sorry all this happened to you, Chicory. I hope facing this helps a little bit. Hopefully. Wait, what am I doing? There we go. Here we go. Tree time. Oh, you did this one first? Oh gosh, fire. Holy crap, we have the power of fire now. Smokey the bear would be very mad at us right now. We're not even, we're not only are we failing to prevent forest fires? We're causing them. I like how each, uh, like, area, like the dark trees have their own gimmicks and stuff. Fun. I wonder if this is gonna play into the boss fight at all. Maybe you could set yourself on fire. That'd be kind of messed up. What the 
the heck? My mouse must have went off screen or something. We could have just been burning these trees down all along. Oh, where am I at? There I am. We're going down here. Woo! Inverted! Kind of like Chicory's room when she got mad at us. Oh, speaking of. We're gonna see the memory. After all this time, all that training, I'm just not good enough for you? Chicory, don't do this. I can't take this anymore. I hate you, Blackberry. I need you out of my life. I'll be a wielder, with or without your blessing. Dang. I notice I use purple a lot. Oh, do they do they have you use purple during boss fights? Because I said that was my favorite color like way earlier on. She's gone. I made a huge mistake. I I should never have. How did I push her so far away? How could I let this happen? I. I'm a monster. What? I'm supposed to be coloring those in there. Oh, there we go. I guess you just, as long as you don't get that initial red explosion, you're allowed to touch the stagnant red. I do find that sometimes the rules of the boss fight aren't super clear to me immediately, but it does seem like they're too punishing though, so... I see you're able to like figure it out without... No, she never understood what it really takes, why I have to be this way. It's not my fault. She's weak. That's not nice to say. not my fault. She should have listened to me. But then, why do I feel so guilty? Did I make her like this? Why couldn't I just fix this? Well, you can't always fix what you want. Uh-oh. But if you try sometime, fix what you need. Oh, the song goes right. Oh, jeez. It's a mass of deadly diamonds. I just wanted to help. I wanted to make her perfect. 
I wanted to be her friend, but she's gone. And I... I can't fix it. She's gone. She's gone. Well, I think I know where to find her. Probably in the Wielder Tower. Just, just got a hunch. I want to go check that out. All right. That's chapter seven in the books. I, I mean, I almost feel like we could finish this tonight because depending on how long it takes us to find the other two corners. Um, I don't know. I think it's doable. Breakfast, breakfast, wake up. Oh, thank goodness. I caught you washing down the river, oh gosh. Thought for a second that, well, I'm glad you're okay. If you were hurt because of me, I don't know what I'd... I'm okay, I'm okay. But Chicory, it wasn't you in there. It was Blackberry. She... I think she feels terrible about what happened. Well, she has a real way of showing it. But I guess that means it really is from the brush. Not just me, and not just you. If Blackberry's there too, it could mean... Every wilder through history is in there somewhere. Trickery, I think you should talk to Blackberry about what happened. She... If she has something to say to me, she could say it herself. True. That's fair. Oh, shoot. This is the trial I never really finished, so... I nearly forgot about the ritual at the end. Ritual? The theme of the trial is master passing on to student. You're supposed to earn the respect of your master. Me. And I'm supposed to formally accept you. Maybe with, like, a handshake or something. But did I earn your respect? Breakfast. You... <laughs> you did way more than earn my respect. So much of this happened because I didn't have anyone to talk to or anywhere to turn. But you've been there for me. You've got a strength that I kind of admire. And I happily accept you as my successor. Yay! Aww. You did it, Breakfast. That's your second Wilder Trial down. Halfway there now. It'll be done in no time. Almost feels like we should celebrate, doesn't it? Celebrate? How? I have no idea. Never did fun stuff when I was a Wilder, or when I was in school, or basically ever. I don't know where people go to just hang out, but we should go to one of those. Well, there's the... Let's go to pizza. Oh, sure, that works. Whichever place you want, let's meet there. See you soon. I guess I should meet her there before we go to the next, uh... ...thing, huh? It's the old Lemonade River. Oh, look, it's Brecky. Hey, oh. oh, can't talk to the other. It's old man river. No, yeah, I don't think, um, I don't think we need to, like, reveal the whole map or anything. We'll probably visit most of the places when we hit up the corners. We'll meet here in dinners real quick. I, w I also wanted to come to dinner so that I could uh, drop off the music at the party. Now that I have a couple music players. Question is, which one do I want to keep for myself? Is this where the party is? No, I think it's in an... That's the mail building. This, I think, is the party. There we go. Hey, rooftop party, huh? This takes me back. Dinners used to be so cool, you know? Rougher and rowdier and ruder and dirtier. We'd party on the rooftops and get in fights. Now everything's so clean and nice and tidy. Full of trees and kindness and junk. I mean, I guess it's actually pretty nice here now, but, like... Is it freedom? I think so. Alright, how do I... How do I drop stuff off? It was like, shh.
Um. Does anyone remember how to uh, put furniture down? You just go here. The core. So, Foundy Record, Big City. I kind of want that Big City Record player from my room, not gonna lie. It's kind of sick. Give you guys the tam deeper. Alt. 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 I guess I was muted that whole time by accident. You know what? I was probably pressing all the different buttons on my keyboard to find the decor button and I hit my mute by accident. No, I, I, I've been reading this the whole time. So yeah, that was my bad. Um, well, no point in reading the rest of this. Uh, she didn't like, feel like a failure. He felt like a failure all the time. Don't think you're a failure. Thought I could finally talk to someone about this. Thought we're friends. I'm glad we're friends too. And then the darkness envelops them all and they all get consumed. Okay. My bad, I was reading that all out loud completely, but I guess I was muted, so. Um. Okay, so we want to go to one of the other corners. Uh. 
find that quick travel spot. The, the music in this town always reminds me of uh, Mario Odyssey. Try this corner. Okay, so we wouldn't have been able to go up here before. Oh no, yeah, we could. <laughs> ah, this stuff. This is weird. This is the best corner I want to do at last. Well, it's too late now, because now here we are. I can, f there we go. So did you end up liking the uh, RE8 DLC, Joe? Because I thought about trying it, but I would have to like rent or buy the game and then buy the DLC just to play it. I like the RE7 DLC a lot. And I like RE8 like way more than RE7, so I think I would, I would probably like enjoy it. DLC was alright, ties up some loose ends, but don't expect much. Okay, so it's just kind of wrapping up the, uh... Oh, look, we already found the right spot now, but I, I need to approach it from another way. So it's kind of like Chris, the Chris DLC in uh, 7, where it just kind of shows you what happens with, like, Lucas and stuff, more or less. Um, okay, how am I gonna get over to the right here? Wait, can I like... Oh, there we go. Whoa, I can go into the clouds. Temporarily. It's raining orange juice. Hallelujah, it's raining orange juice. Puffy jacket, we better put that on, it's getting cold. There we go. The Chris one does way more. This one felt rushed. One of the main villains is the Duke. The Duke is a villain? But he doesn't do anything really. He feels like they wanted to use him more. Huh. That's, I don't know how I feel about the Duke being a villain because he actually helps you out in a... Like, most of the game he's like, you're unsure of... He just can't kind of seems neutral. Aside from he is technically helping you out, but you just don't know if you can really trust him. But he, he like... Towards the very end of Village, he, he like... He helps you. So that's actually kind of weird to me. Oh, it's in a weird dream world. Okay. I see. Where am I? Oh, I was in the club. Had a great segment in that creepy dollhouse, though. Interesting. Sounds like you might be revisiting uh, locations or something, huh? I mean, I'll probably check out the DLC at, at some point. I, just, I don't know if it'll be anytime soon, though.
Uh, am I not? Oh, I thought I was on the cliff. Oh, dang it, I was supposed to go to swimming mode. I gotta keep track of everything here. There we go. I did it. Alright, we made it. Furthermore, up this rock that's here for some. One thing in this game that feels a little bit like almost like an old flash game in terms of like just kind of a weird feel to it is when you're pushing those orbs. Something about it. You made it breakfast. I hope you're ready for this trial because of because for this one, you're going to climb to the very top of Desert Peak. What? What does that have to do with being the wilder? Good question. I guess it's not really about the mountain. The theme of this trial is rising to wilder status. It's symbolic. But it is the trial, so let's get climbing. But I don't want to climb a mountain. Who needs climb a mountain? It's safer at the docks. But there ain't no stream, the soda pops are skipping down the rocks. It's dangerous and risky, but adventurous and free. Adventure, that's the life for me. Oh, that's a giant present. got a new texture. Oh, it's snowing up here. What the heck? I just realized. On account of everything being black and white. Wait a minute. Is this your favorite part because there's penguins? Oh no, there's never like random people in the trial areas, right? Oh, this reminds you of a certain something, I see. That would explain why this would be your favorite trial. What does climbing a mountain have to do with being the wilder? It doesn't. It's just an elaborate reference to another game you see. Oh. Shut us. Uh, RE8 DLC isn't 100% worth it. Left more questions than answers. If you want to tie up the winter story sloppily, then check it out. Wait a minute. So, all that stuff they tease at the end of Village is just tied up, like, hastily in the DLC. And so re 9s just gonna have nothing to do with that? I, I thought that that was, like, gonna be RE9. It's kind of weird. So we really have no idea what uh, nine's gonna be then, huh? It also just seems like it would be more appropriate for it to be done in three parts, I feel like. Uh, I don't know. What do I know? I'm just a video game boy. I guess if I want to get that trash, I can go that way, but if I don't want to get that trash, I could just go this way. I can get a present instead. 
A wind tree. Yeah, let's wear that. the life for me. Oops. I don't think that's gonna read so I'm gonna have to push that up next time. There we go. That's enough. That works. Probably an achievement for blowing up like every rock though but it's fine. One of the nicest paint color palettes, especially if you use more than one color. It's very pastel y, huh? It's like the sister DLC in RE7 where it doesn't really do much. Like the Rose DLC for 8 is just like some random stuff. It takes place 18 years later. The sister DLC in 7. Is that where you play as Jack's brother. I liked that DLC a lot. It was weird, but it was cool. Wondering when you catch up. How'd you climb up here so fast? Well, you are, she is a rabbit. You don't even have brush powers. I've got strong legs. You feel ready to rise to the status of wielder? I'm not uh, sure I even understand what that means. But I guess the answer is no. When I think about a wielder, I don't think of someone like me. I think about someone strong, and cool, and confident. You thought I was a good wielder, right? The best. But now that you know me, do I really seem cool and confident to you? Well, <laughs> I do think you're strong, Chicory. You felt so terrible and frightened, but you're still here helping me. That's strength. Well, you're still here too, helping me. Gosh, this is just great. Let me just take a moment to appreciate. I understand what you mean about the strong wielder. That's who I wished I was too. I was trying so hard to look perfect, but I was so lonely and afraid that if anyone ever saw the real me, the spell would be broken and nobody would care about me anymore. That's what I thought had happened. That's why I treated you like a lowly janitor for 50 years. Anyway, I didn't think you'd ever come back. Chicory, you don't have to be perfect for anyone to care about you. I guess I came back because I thought we were friends. Thanks. For staying there and talking to me. Even though I was horrible to you. I didn't deserve it, but thank you. I don't want things to get that bad again. Chicory, I don't really know how to put this, but I'm glad I got to see the real you. I don't think I realized how little I knew about you before all this. You felt so above me back then. I know that's not the truth. I know you're just another person like me. You're still also someone I admire, who I want to learn from, flaws and all. You don't have to hide that from me. I want to be able to be there for you, when you need it. Thanks, janitor. I mean breakfast. That means a lot. And same to you. I'm gonna keep climbing. Good luck with the rest, breakfast. I'll see you at the top. Oh, there she goes. Back, what happened? Did you, uh... Did you fall down? Did you sleep on a rock? Why does your why is your everything in pain? I just one of the kittens were lost up here. <laughs> Probably something to the right there, but... Oh, no, we have to go to the right. Wait, do we? Yeah, because we're going to have to push that ball down. You got turbo boosted? What the heck does that mean? 
Oh, like, did you get your, your, like, booster shot? Is that what it is? Turbo boosted. There we go. Oh, there's like a second booster shot. I still need to get my first one. I haven't got my first one yet. So you're like sore and stuff? When I got my first dose, I remember that was like when I felt the worst off of it. And then the second one didn't feel as bad. Um, I don't know if that's common or if it was just a coincidence. Wait, whoops. That was what I was doing. Oh, that, I wasn't waiting. I keep jumping the gun. There we go. Those explosive flowers are pretty convenient. It's your third booster? Wait, are you are you even allowed to get that many? I feel like that Like I knew there was a second booster coming out. I have not heard of a th third one. That is news to me. D is the booster like the worst so far? It hurt a bad. Ooh, fuzzy jacket. That looks nice. Even have her hands in her pockets, it looks like. Oh wait, I needed to push that up first. Let me reset that. Not responding. There it goes. So I need to stop it while it's, while it's right here. No, wrong side. Oh, great. What the? Okay, I don't know how that happened. I'm gonna follow it. Shot right past me. Yeah, I'm there we go. Darn it, I don't know if that's close enough. Ah, it was close enough to paint it, but not to destroy it. I need to get him more left. Okay, that gotta be it. There we go. Wait a minute, was that just for trash? Oh! The real path is up there. I didn't even realize that.
I did all that just for trash. I mean, trash is nice and all, but... Okay. Time it when it's raining out. There we go. I don't like getting the uh, shots as much as the next person, but you know, I don't got a choice. I'm a busy man. I got places to go. I got people to see. nothing down there. Right? Do you see anything down there? I don't see anything down there. Weird, I thought there'd be something down there. Are flu shots free without health insurance? I don't have health insurance. The only reason I even could get the vaccination is because it is free. You're almost there. The peak is just up ahead. You can relax in the spring too if you want. But don't ride the waterfall down. It's a shortcut to the bottom of the mountain. Unless you feel like climbing it up again. What happens if you actually go down there? What if it's a super secret? Most colleges give them out for free. I know that's how you get back down. She just told me that, but uh, but she she warned you not to go down it. But what if you what if that's just a red herring? and you do go down it, and you get a secret super bonus prize. Because they want to make you reclimb all that all over again just because of a little mistake like that, right? I think we should try, we should go for it. I think there's a super secret down there. That sword is like trying to keep me from getting so that so the sword can be the ultimate chicory player. And I'm not falling for it. I'm gonna get the secret. Okay, we'll do that later. Don't ride the snake. You wanna wanna ride on a snake? That'd be like that'd be epic. You did it, breakfast. This is the peak. It's so quiet. Yeah, I love it. There's one last part to this trial. We're gonna sing a song together. What the heck? The second time we're singing a song today. Huh? I'm not much of a singer. That's okay. It's an ancient wielder anthem. I don't remember the words though. So we might have to just make it up. We're meant to stand at the edge and look out at the view as we sing. Make your way to the edge when you're ready. I... 
Here we go. Let's do it. Just a click when it does. Space or something? Oh, there we go. No, yeah, I was clicking when the circle was going down. It just wasn't making a noise for some reason. I don't know what Osu is. That's not the song. Inside. I was muted the whole time, sorry. What I was saying is I, I didn't understand a single lyric because I was focused on the rings, but I didn't I couldn't figure out the rings either. Cause there would be a solid black line sometimes, but then when there was a bunch of rings coming at once, the uh Um Oh, you know what happened? At the very start of it, I went to take a drink, so I muted my mic. And then I noticed, like, oh, suddenly it was a rhythm game. So I put my drink down and I just started playing it and I forgot to unmute myself. Um, uh, yeah. And I could, I didn't, I didn't understand. Uh, yeah, but no, I didn't get a single lyric of that because like I was trying to figure out the ring thing. Um, and I, the, uh, I still, I still didn't get it by the end of it because I feel like when you do it right, there's like a black, it tur it turns solid black, the ring and you click on it and it explodes. But then other times, um, it, when it, turn solid like when there was multiple rings i could only get the solid black one time i don't know that was kind of weird 
Um, actually, I muted on purpose. The accident was that I, I didn't unmute because it caught me off guard that that started happening. Uh... Anyway, let's get back to this. Uh, you had nothing to worry about breakfast. Your singing voice is really nice. <laughs> I don't... Yours is too. Great job, breakfast. You just finished your third wielder trial. Only one left now. And then before long, it'll be time to face the corruption in the tower. How are you feeling about that? A bit scared, to be honest. Understandable. I've been thinking a lot about what we should do when this is all over. But it's probably too soon to get into it. I'll be waiting for you at the last trial. See you. I I did notice uh, at at one point you said that to turn the um the brush style, which I didn't um I didn't catch right away. So my bad about that. It's weird. It feels like they should have like taught you how to do that before throwing you in there because I just completely I, I really wanted to see what they were singing but I I just had no way I could keep track of that there's a fellow down here a frog detective what the heck everyone has a name and then you're just frog detective The circle, j I just clicked on it one time and I didn't understand the rhythm or whatever. Like, I didn't understand like how the rhythm went to it or how the, um, I don't know. I just didn't, like, I was trying my best, but I couldn't figure it out. I like rhythm games too. I just didn't know what they wanted for me, really. Um, and you guys were saying Osu, but I don't know what Osu is, also. I'm the frog detective. Hi. Before you ask, I can't help you solve any mysteries right now. I'm actually here on vacation. I do really love to solve mysteries, but it's important to take breaks sometimes, too. Even from things that you love. That's really fair and reasonable. Thank you. There was there were single words inside of the rings, but they were like all going at different times, so I didn't know like which one to look at at which time. And then also there was other words going aside from the words inside of the lyrics. I assume because Trickery was singing some and Breakfast was singing some. So it was all just mixed up completely. I'd, uh, all I know is me and Trickery said like two words at the same time at one point. I've heard of the Elite Beat agents. But I, I've never uh, played it or anything. See, sorry, I didn't know that. I thought that there was two sets of lyrics going at once, which made my brain even less uh, to catch any of them. But at the same time, I was trying to figure out the timing with the ring thing, or how the ring thing worked exactly. Uh-oh. It's a catastrophe. Well, that's uh, unfortunate for you, you guys. Let's go this way. <laughs> it's a catastrophe. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, you're saying I should have did that side quest? Whoops. Well, if we're ever back in that area, which we probably... Oh no, we've already done the bottom left, haven't we? We want to do the bottom right now. All right, fine. Since we, uh, um, since we're doing pretty good on time, I guess we could go do that, whatever that is. I didn't even realize that that was Summer Springs, to be honest. I thought we were in Desert Peak. I mean, Desert Peak. 
Dark said, I'm struggling to think of any examples, but it's very likely you've seen Osu or a game like Osu. I do not know what Osu is. Osu. With an exclamation point? I've never seen this, and I've never played this. This just looks just as confusing as what we just as what we were just doing, actually. If not more so. Well, there's no lyrics on the screen though, so that probably would have made it help a little bit. Anyway, let's go see what's going on here. Butterscotch. This resort is done for, I tell you, done for. Now, now, that may be a bit of an exaggeration. I would never, ever exaggerate. We're the victims of grand larceny. All the furniture in our presidential suite was stolen. See, in fact, because you said, uh, fact said, sometimes you click and drag, sometimes you mash, and sometimes you single click. And that was the thing that I couldn't figure out for a lot of those multi notes during that song. I didn't know if I was supposed to click multiple times or hold it or what, but it didn't seem like it was ever working. All the furniture in our presidential suite was stolen. Everything is hopeless. I'll take the case. Dude, we should go get that frog detective to help. I don't know anything about investigating, but I'll try to help. Thank goodness. Please come see for yourself. Uh... Wow, it's really empty. Yes, it is. And VIP guests are coming any time now. You've got to begin the investigation right away. Why does this feel like it'll be the longest side quest in the game and Sword just pushed me into it? Luckily, I've seen enough TV to know how that works. You need to take photos of evidence. Okay, sure. What is evidence? Why, there's a piece of evidence right here. The ink splots. Open up your camera, zoom in, and snap a picture to collect the evidence. Including this, I imagine there's four pieces of evidence around Simmer Springs. It's a very specific number. Good luck. Oh, actually, one more thing. If you have any spare decor, would you place some here? I'll remain here to oversee the redesign of the presidential suite. Thank you. That's a lot to ask of the investigator, but I think I do actually have some uh, spare decor. Here's a sleeping bag. Here's a picnic blanket. There's a beach towel, violin, give you the nice couch, how about that? I don't think you should have a campfire inside of a hotel, but it'll probably be fine. And there you go, I think you're probably that's good, right? Hmm, yes. The suite isn't quite presidential yet. It needs some more miscellaneous items and objects. There should be items in, on the walls. Oh, on the walls. Oh gosh, that drawing that Chicory did for me. There's the fan art that that one guy did. Put that on the wall. Like Fidel Castro or something. Oh, without the beard. Fidel Castro is a Mario brother. Still looking for more furniture here. There should be some items on the walls. What, what the heck? More? You're bleeding me dry here. We have a strawberry clock. What would you do if you checked into a hotel sword and there was just like a fungus clock and a fungus painting? 
Do you have some more items here? It needs some more miscellaneous objects. I feel horrible that our guests are waiting to see it. Really? Jeez, Louise. How many more items do you need? I'm gonna run out. There's a plant. Um. There's another plant. It's growing through the floor. Magically. Is that enough now? There we go. Man, this guy took like half of my stuff. It's funny that his little fan drawing it doesn't look any worse than my ori the original drawing. I'd like to ask you a few questions, of course. Where were you when all this stuff went missing? I was on a break. I had stepped out to get a breath of fresh air. When I came back, Miss, uh, Miss Butterscotch was in a fit. That's when I found out what happened. A likely story. I know, it's very likely. It's very likely and also true. Well, okay. Let me know when you found all the evidence. Oh, I thought we automatically grabbed that up there. Wait, well, what is our mom doing up here? What the heck? Is she a prime suspect? Our mom's in the evidence picture. Breakfast, you decorated the suite, didn't you? Call it a mother's sixth sense. Okay. I've been working hard lately, so I thought I'd come for a soak. Soak? Of course, I couldn't get dad to come. He's married to the holy that holy shop. Breakfast, I know you like to work hard like your dad, but I hope you remember to take breaks sometimes, too. So we need to go find evidence. I don't know if it's just going to be splotches scattered around. It would have made more sense if we found the detective after starting that case. <laughs> I'm actually trying to solve a mystery right now. All the furniture in the presidential suite was stolen. Oh. Wow. I'll be honest, that sounds really fun. I'm trying really hard not to think about that mystery. I'm working on creating clear personal boundaries to improve my work-life balance. Yeah, I hear that. How's your work-life balance? Um, pretty bad, I guess. I feel exhausted basically all the time. There's a lot of problems to solve right now. It feels like it's my job to take care of them all. I totally understand that. I feel the same way about mysteries. I found it's helpful to set rules for myself. Designating times or places where I'm not allowed to work. For example, I'm not solving any mysteries on my vacation. Or never solving a mystery on Saturday. It can feel a bit arbitrary, but it helps me maintain myself, so I think it's good to do. There will always be more mysteries when you come back. Well, that specific advice is more for me. But maybe some aspect of it applies to you. Thanks, Frog Detective. That's like people who have, um, they only check their work email certain days at certain times of the day. Oh. So there's three more of those that we need, I think. Frog Detective doesn't like books? Why that's preposterous. Oh gosh. I've never been over here. Egg. I love climbing, that's why I live here. I get to go for a nice hike every morning. Nothing grounds me more. Feeling the dirt between my toes. Uh, does that mean we're going to get all our furniture back when we solve the mystery? Or are they going to have an excuse to keep all that furniture? Well, hmm, 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 um, um, um. nothing suspicious here. 
let's talk to this guy. Chili. Hi, I love to steal. It's the funnest thing ever. If you need anything stolen, just let me know. Other hobbies besides stealing? Well, let me think. The shifty eyes. <laughs> I do enjoy video games from time to time. Okay. Um... Go ahead and take a picture. Hey! Why are you taking photos of my cool cave, which contains absolutely no stolen goods at all? Pretty sure that's against the law somehow. You seem totally suspicious. Well, there's a huge pile of evidence beneath you. Liquid evidence. The only evidence I see is a really suspicious photographer. You probably stole the furniture from the resort. Huh? I didn't say anything about the resort. Consider yourself an official suspect. Yeah, well... Okay. No, no argue. No argument. Alright, we need to find three more liquid evidence. Is that a red panda? Biscuit? Gravy, yes! It had to be gravy. Yes! That's how you do it, baby. We're adventurers, if you couldn't tell. Treasure hunters, to be more specific. We scour picnic looking for treasure. Yeah, we have our own treasures, too. Top secret treasures. Uh, do you want to know about them? Sure. I, I hope if you say I'm good that they still tell you. Our treasures hidden across the entire picnic province. I'll show those secret places to you now. The secret tree. Oh, is that like when we find the gifts that are invisible? Because we've stumbled on a couple of those, I think. If you do find those places, you'll have to tap repeatedly on the marked spot to reveal the treasure. That's the secret. Okay. Whoops. Oh gosh, it's almost Walter time. We're gonna have to take a Walter break soon. So there's no evidence on this screen. I have to go in another direction. Can't go up from here. Oh wait, no, we only need two more because we found that spot up there. I go downstream I feel like I can't go up from here but darn how am I gonna get back up here when I go down though because I need to get back oh here we go there's a path okay, so I'll have to remember to come up this way Is this another dead end? Oh, no, it's not. Jeez, we just found two cats in a row. Uh oh, how do I get up there? We're supposed to go behind the hotel. These are in the way and I can't get this cat. Oh well. A cat will just... Oh, there's no evidence down here. Well, like this way? Oh, you mean like a... Off the hotel? Hello. We came to Simmer Spring for the famous Skyview. Had this trip booked for months, but I have to admit, it's 
Probably not the same without color. No. I'm glad we caught you here. Could you color the sky back in? I was just gonna do that for you, actually. I mean, you can't just ask the world to do things for you like that. No, it's okay. Alright, uh, blue would be the obvious color. Give you a nice red sky. That's actually kind of straining on the eyes. It looks like a virtual boy. <laughs> oh man, sky painted how you wanted? Yep. Ah! Uh, wow. Wow. Really is so romantic. Can't believe we got to be here to see you paint it. We're the first people to ever see this sky. This trip wound up even more special than we hoped. Haha, <laughs> it's true. Thanks so much. Oh, hang on. Before we get on here... What the... You guys come from? Wow, leave it to breakfast to paint a sky as gorgeous as this. Wish I knew more about art. I can't put into words the feelings your work gives me. All I know is it's good and I love it. And this is one of the old uh, wielders, I think. Now just paint little green crosses at the bottom and a big white lady? I don't understand. What a nice sky. I heard and wanted to come see for myself. You put a lot of thought into it when you're drawing. Not really. Me neither, haha. <laughs> Sometimes I overthink it, but that's just because I don't know what I'm doing. Doesn't it feel strange to be considered an important artist when you're just making stuff by feeling and intuition? That's how I felt anyway. I think we have a lot in common. Oh, this is just to get that gift. I guess we'll just grab that real quick. Top hat. Or why not? Look like a leprechaun. You're gonna have to explain that little green crosses. I can't do green. Yeah, sorry. There's another doggy. I thought I was the only dog in the world, besides my mom. Are you here on vacation too? This is my favorite spot to get away to, walking in the snowy mountains and soaking in the hot springs. It's fab as can be. A lot of trash by the trash can. Kind of redundant to pick up trash near the trash can. I almost feel like that's cheating. That's Fak's favorite character. I don't see a door anywhere. Oh, it, I didn't even notice those ink spots because it was near a trash can, so my brain just thought, oh, that's just like garbage stains. Oh, they are named Rice. Now I get it. What is it? There's a pretty suspicious bunch of evidence around you here. Evidence? What are you doing back here anyway? Oh, I don't know. I think I'm lost. So you don't know anything about missing furniture? No? Exactly what a criminal would say. You're free to go for now. But you're officially a suspect. I've never been suspected of something. Well, I'll do my best. You'll do your best as a suspect. You can't push them off a cliff, past tense. Alright, so there's one more piece of evidence I need to find. Um, and we're not supposed to go down there, apparently. Oh, 
Oh, I did find it all? Well, there was the one in the cave. There was the one near the frog detective. There was the one by the dumpster. That's only three. They said there was... I thought they said there was the one in the hotel and then four more in the area. That's what I thought they meant. Can I ask you about the investigation? Don't talk to me about it now, it's much too much for my poor old heart. But I have to ask you questions. Where were you when this stuff was stolen? I have a very strict routine I follow every day. I'm usually behind the front desk, wearing a blindfold, listening to relaxing music. Blindfolded? Keep my nerves uh, calm. Well, did you hear anything? Like I said, I was listening to relaxing music through soundproof headphones. I also always have the volume turned up very loud. That way it's very, very relaxing. I do that for about 12 hours every day. Um, really all I have to say about the investigation. Quince, my concierge, will handle it moving forward. Please just speak to her. Looks like you found all the evidence. Are you ready to begin the final interrogation? Yes. We only have two suspects. <laughs> so it's either the dog or the... The... that... the way that the um... This like alligator or whatever he is... The way he looks is so familiar for some reason. Oh, I already figured out who did it. <laughs> yeah, that's the only picture we needed. Is the joke that in the Frog Detective game, you actually do have to use the evidence to figure out who did it? It was obviously chilly. What? Well, hey, that's not fair. You can't just decide that based on such flimsy evidence. I was excited to be interrogated too. Fine. Rice, did you steal the furniture? Why no, I didn't. Then how do you explain this evidence? I found that outside just when you did. It looks like squeeze. Squeeze. You know the sweet liquid from fruits? That's... that's what... I didn't know that that's what they called that. Why would Squeeze be all over Simmer Springs? Because I stole it! Wait, what? The band AHA. They stole Squeeze? Alright, I have to do Walter time real quick, and then we'll come back to the exciting conclusion and see who it is that actually stole the furniture, because as of right now, it could be anyone. Pretty excited. You guys can put your theories in the chat of who you think stole the furniture while I'm gone, and then we'll uh, we will confirm our or uh, who our suspect. Just, uh... do, 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 do. Better, so you better make the right pick. 
Select the one to fight with, get it on. Ten nine eight seven six. Pick and choose the right one, get it on. Five four three two one. Yeah. Select the one to fight with. Doctor Peace. Listen.
than that her mother talks no more. The end of the dream. Oh, I forgot to send my back in a bit comment. Shining fish flashes in a stream. And the virgin child closes his playlist. Okay. Um. When the wind blows, a virgin child comes inside. Oh wait, I need to unmute this. All right, the thrilling conclusion of this mystery. All right. Norwegian pop band, aha. So you did steal the furniture. No, I wish I stole the furniture, but I did steal a bunch of squeeze. That's why it was all over my feet. Why would you still squeeze? Because I love to steal. It is a fun and rewarding activity. I feel like we're losing the plot. There was squeeze at the scene of the crime. Uh-oh. And some behind the resort, strangely. The only other place I found squeeze was out by the hot springs. Chili, are you saying you spilled squeeze in all those places? Oh, no. Just my cave. I don't know anything about that other stuff. Oh. Then the culprit. It must have been. Yeah, I have an idea. I think I give up. Okay, I admit it. I was just checking on the presidential suite while enjoying my favorite squeeze when disaster struck. I spilled squeeze everywhere and I just couldn't clean it up. No matter what I tried, those guilty stains remain. So I got desperate. I thought the furniture just needed a bath. And so I dragged it all behind the resort and out to the hot springs and dumped it all in the water. Everything sank to the bottom instantly. It's gone. It's all gone. And it's all my fault. I'm the worst hotel employee. I'm so sorry, everyone. Well, you're going to prison. Nothing we can do. Wince. It's okay, dearie. What? It's okay, I forgive you. It was terrifying when I thought we'd been robbed, knowing that it was just you. Well, I'm relieved. We have breakfast to replace all the furniture anyway. Oh yeah, that's my job now, giving you free furniture. So whatever. Ahem, I see. Well, that will be all then. Thank you all for coming. And thank you, Breakfast, for your diligent interrogation. We can consider this case officially closed. Achieve and unlock turnabout squeeze. Oh, there you go. Wait, I didn't get a reward or nothing? Thank you again. Certainly regret some of my choices here today. I'd really appreciate your discretion concerning my uh, unfortunate habit of imbibing vast quantities of squeeze. It's unbecoming for an esteemed employee such as myself. Oh, are they like a fruit bat? Like a vampire fruit bat? Quince has worked here for a long time. Frankly, I don't think this place could run without her. So I'm willing to not quiet over spilled squeeze and let bygones be bygones. Hopefully that never happens again though. Out of all the people to not give us a, a, a present for a, a reward for winning, it's the rich hotel people. It's those darn one percenters back at it again. Keens? I don't know what Keens is. I've never had that, I don't think. Okay, so we have one more corner here to visit, and it's like the farthest away from our nearest uh, quick travel.
You know, I still don't know what a soft or strong letter is. I always hear that, like, oh, a strong A sound or a, a weak. I don't even, I don't know what that means. I probably was taught at one point and I just completely forgot. I, I don't feel like that's intuitively a thing that you would be like, oh, a strong A, it's this. I don't know. At least I personally never... Um... I wonder if we should try approaching this from a different... ...way. Because this, I think, is just gonna lead us to a dead end. Oh no, I was never hooked on phonics. I remember seeing the TV commercials all the time, though. I think... My mom probably thought, well, he's pretty good with English for his age already. Because that was actually one of my stronger things as a kid. Like, I actually was pretty good with uh, English stuff. Oh, I know voiced and unvoiced because uh, only because we just were recently learning about that in linguistics. So that, that I do know. Oh, a gift. Oh. I just realized I just ended up going the same way as if I had just taken the vines. This is new. Uh, it still looks like we're just headed towards somewhere we've already been. This is just a present, so I think we could just forget this. I need to go like a long way around, I think. Well, this is a dead end, too. Darn it, I think this is even where we fast traveled to. <laughs> I've been looking at the map, sword. Don't... Don't try to... Say that I ain't been looking at the map, cause I have been. I'll tell you right here, right now. I'm just gonna try to go from around this way, I guess. to go through the cave again? These little tiny rocks are blocking our path. About to say that was
Okay, hopefully this... Oh, that just took us back here again. Gosh, darn it. What are my thoughts on Neil uh, Gaiman? The name sounds somewhat familiar, but I don't think I know who that is. Oh, that's just for that present. Jump over here now. Hang on, we might be, we might be getting somewhere. Foxy? But I'm a dog. Doggies can't be foxy. What were we talking about yesterday? Neil Gaiman? I don't remember talking about a Neil Gaiman person. Author of Sandman and American Gods, co-author of Godom. Oh! Yeah, well that must be why the name sounded vaguely familiar. If I don't see a name written out uh, a lot, I can, it, do, it doesn't stick in my mind as well. Like if I hear a name said, if that made sense, if that makes sense. I don't know if that has to do with just like the type of brain I have. It's almost just like I hear someone will tell me a new name and my brain will just register enough of it to be like, oh yeah, that's a name. And then it'll start focusing on the rest of the conversation and it like won't retain that name at all. It'll store it in the most deepest subconscious area that's like not going to be accessed again. Um... Is that a freaking Mario Sunshine uh, graffiti right there? It, it looks very s similar, except I guess it's supposed to be an M. I don't know, something about that just giving Mario Sunshine vibes. I didn't, I mean, I didn't know who it was. I think the name just was vaguely familiar because you brought him up again. Because you probably brought him up before. So my brain was like, oh yes, I do know this name, but it never made that connection. This is a plant? This little... these black scribbles? Ah, there we go. I don't understand how the directioning works on this guy. So I know we want to get up here. Now we want this to come down this way. Decide which way you want it to go. As long as it works, that's all that matters. Oh, we made it. Wait. Hey breakfast, doesn't the rain feel nice? The theme of this trial is honoring wilder history. You'll need to collect the unique br uh, brush flowers that grow here. Like that sparkly one over there. I found five flowers around the rainforest, but for the trial you can just bring me four. Meet me ahead when you find them. Oh, I want the sparkly one. Oh.
If this one has kind of a weird hit detection, like the uh, the Bug Queen had like the same issue. Like 99% of the things in the game, the hit detection's fine, but once in a while, get something weird. Because I cannot change the direction of this at all. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to see if we can, um... I'm literally hovering right over it. Look, you can see that the circle is over the flower and I click and it's not clicking on it. So, I mean, I don't know. I think we can see here. All right, we found one. Yeah, well, because originally I was trying to click on the bottom, the leaves to to move it down, but it it's that doesn't work. It on, it only seems to want to go in one direction. I get it. The pulsing ones, right? Scientist. Oh, what the... Okay, apparently that's... Do I need to go up there though? I don't know if I have to. Yeah, I don't see a reason why I'd even want to get up here. Well, I'm not really thinking about the colors. I'm trying to solve the puzzles because I don't really care about coloring the stuff that I want to be honest. Because it's just everything's black and white. It's like at a certain point, it's like, okay, you know, things will, color is going to happen eventually. It's, it's a lot to, uh, it's kind of putting your eggs in a lot of, all your eggs in one basket in a sense, where is the person going to, um, get sick of the coloring or not? That looks like I should be able to land up there. Perception. Tricky at times. I, I'm just not thinking about the color. I, I can only focus on one thing at a time, really. If I'm painting something, like, consciously, then I'll, I'll uh, think about the colors. But if I'm just trying to solve a puzzle or something, that's... The color, the specific colors I'm using aren't really on my mind. Darn it, I fell. Mm -hmm. 
this so far is uh, probably the the uh, puzzle mechanic that I'm not the biggest fan of. Probably partly just because I'm just not. There's something about it that I just don't get. I feel like I should be able to drop this to my level, but I, I see. I don't know if this is lined up to me or if this is higher than I am. I actually can't tell. If it's not to my level, what else would I do here? Okay. I was worried about falling in. The flowers from Wandersong. You know, I played a little tiny bit of Wandersong. That was actually one of the first games I ever streamed. And the main reason I stopped playing is because, um... I was just doing so much reading that it was killing my voice. I think I was, like, especially not used to doing a lot of talking or reading during a stream. Maybe I should continue that one day. Because I was enjoying it a lot. I just, uh... It was really just the reading was killing my voice. I don't, I don't think that the placement and the depth is the same though, because this is the bottom, and that's definitely not at the bottom level. It's more at the, uh... It's like a layer above me. I know there's a way to drop the flowers down, but I don't... Oh. That's what we want. Oh, wait. Hang on. Maybe from here, then I could land on it. Oh, never mind. No, that's still too far. That's gonna be too far as well. I'm kinda stumped on this one. not see that there. A Jason Pollock plant. That's a good name for that. I like the poly the explosive plants could be called that though. Well Oh, Jackson Paul. Jason is his lesser known uh, brother. Of course. All of that for a freaking present. Oh, I thought we were progressing. Oh, geez. It's just a big dark square. Jason Pollock. Hang on. Was there maybe something down there I missed before, just before we leave? No, no, no. That's definitely a dip. Darn, so that was... Okay. There we go. Oh, it's one of the plants. I just didn't need uh, two more of those. You should stream universally beloved game Heavy Rain sometime. I'd be down to stream that. Hmm. 
That looks like it's too high. Okay. I think I see what I'm supposed to do. And then from here... Stormy? Where? Oh. Oh darn, that was just the one flower at the end. Of By the way, I feel like I'm gonna miss those flowers very easily, so definitely point out if there's one on the screen. I know they sparkle, but since everything is uh, black and white or random like colors, uh, they're not going to stand out very well for me. Like, I already feel like I missed one. Oops. Oh, there's one right over there. How do I get to that? Oh, that's the reason why I would want to get up on that flower, but I couldn't figure out how to do that anyways. The music always sounds like the credits to like a a coming of age movie from the 90s. In this area, I mean. This seems a little too high. Darn it. See, these can reach each other, but how would I get up here in the first place? Oh, I think I know. I don't get what's what. Okay. I need to get up here. I wasn't thinking of that is because I didn't realize like at what height they were exactly. But now I know. Now from here I can come down here. There we go. That is our third brush flower. It means there's one more we still need to get. I hope it's in this direction. Or else we might, we might be in trouble. Well, how the heck am I supposed to get down from here? Oh. I should just jump into the colored water and start swimming, but apparently I need to just like take the long way back. This worries me because I feel like this was the start of the uh yeah, I've never gone this way. Okay, good. This looks like it's a newer area. Bolt T. We're all lightning now. Now this would just be get for getting back, I guess. So let's just go. Whoops. Oh, 
Wait, what's up here though? Nothing on this. Weird. Would I be worried if YouTube is still processing HD on my video 24 hours later? I think sometimes it just does that. There's a chance that it's screwed up and you have to redo it. Or if you just redid it, it would just probably instantly go to HD much quicker. Um, but I think sometimes it just takes really long because YouTube is being dumb. I noticed that though when you're... You, I, I saw your video like only like 10 minutes or so after it was uploaded. And I noticed that it was in 360p still. So it might just be taking its time. Oh, it's in 1080 now. Okay, well that's an improvement from when I had seen it. Wait, what the heck? How did I get over here? Okay, this can't be the right direction. Yeah, there should be an option for that, I agree. Because otherwise you just have to have to schedule ahead of time, like, to give it extra time. But it shouldn't take 24 hours. That definitely seems like a problem. Banquet Rainforest. We were here already. But we gotta be in this area in order to find the things probably. I think I must have left the area by accident. Depending on if YouTube is deciding to pick on you or not, you also have to, uh... Oh darn, now that I'm down here, how would I get back up to the flower? Can I just stand on it and... Turn it. No! What have I done? What's the point of being able to come down here? Oh, I see. Okay, I was getting worried there. Um... Yeah. But yeah, if YouTube just decides, like, it's gonna pick on you, they'll even, like... They'll even, like, delay your monetization for your videos, for some reason. Like, they'll take extra long to, uh, to confirm it. Alright, I wish I knew where I had to go next for my next, uh, flower. So I, I got one down there, but I also got up here as well. And then this just leads down to where he is, and I don't have them yet. Maybe I have to go off to the right first. Hopefully this is where we need to go. In some instances, you can't actually jump right into the inky water. Oh, is this not? Okay, not an open. Uh, okay, because we're coming down this way. Oh, I just went through a vine without color. I didn't know you could do that. There it is, there's the last one. Uh, heck, this was the, the simplest one yet. Okay. 
You can do the hold fill to get around issues where trees block your paint. Uh... If there was a fifth one, I sure as heck didn't see it, so, well. Uh... Nice, you got all the brush flowers you need. I'll be taking those, okay? Meet me up ahead. There's something you need to see. Oh, I'm in there. I was like, where am I? <laughs> I thought that Chicory was saying when she did the trial, she found five, but we only need to find four. That that's how I interpreted her uh she was saying. I didn't I didn't realize she meant literally whoops. I didn't know I was gonna send me back here. Um Literally right now she did. Not bad. smithereens. Dorky. Well, I mean, there's a fine line between Dorky and uh, Suave, apparently. They look like a nice suit. you down that way. And hopefully push you down this way. No. Hmm. Ah, that's probably what it is. Okay, from here, can I push you onto this and then onto that? Yeah, I don't know if you were here earlier, Fact, but I actually said that the, the orbs are probably like the one thing in the game that feel like it, it reminds me of like a like an older like flash game physic physics type of feel to it. Um mostly everything else works pretty well. But also I think there's just something I'm supposed to be doing to get this onto the next spot. But I don't Push that there. Maybe I need to get it like really high up. Oops. So like another. Okay, so now that's all the way up there, but I'm down here now is a problem. But also, I don't think that helped. <laughs> where does the orb start? I don't remember where the orb starts. Let's see. over here. Ah, okay. Like under the leaf for a second. See, I thought I was trying to get it like down the opposite direction. Uh 
Oh, why am I pushing? Yeah, I'm glad you can't accidentally blow the bomb up while you're clicking the leaf. It, seemingly, it feels like it. Alright. Whoops. See, how do you have time to think about color when you have all these this other stuff you're doing? Hey, these all look like the... Uh, it's one of these, aren't they? One of these are, is the, well, the fifth one. Because they all look like the brush flowers, don't they? I don't know how you would tell how which one's which, though. They click all of them. Oh well. Hey, she's down there. What's up here? Grant present? They're all brush flowers, but they don't count for the hunt. I should just pick, um... I wonder what's up here though. Why would it? Why would it lead you back here? Oh well. Um. What if I just picked all of these and I'm like, I found all of these trickery. I swear. Beautiful, right? So the story goes that once a long, long time ago, this huge tree spontaneously sprouted here, and that branch that's missing now, that was the brush. Wow. This is where it first came to be, and where someone became the first wielder. They don't know who that someone is? That's how far back it goes? The brush flowers only grow from this tree, so for this trial, we find the stray brush flowers that spread elsewhere, and replant them here. That's a little... Um... Like, uh... Restrictive, isn't it? These, these, these poor little brush flowers are trying to like spread out and like go into more parts of the world and they're like no we have to bring them back they're only allowed here we got brush flowers look I got brush flowers you can place those from your decor menu plant them all on the screen here let me know when you're happy with where they are Okay. Can I plant flowers that aren't brush flowers? Is that illegal? <laughs> That's how you know that these are my brush flowers because they're next to the big plant. This plant is defending my flowers actually. I did it. There we go. Who was the first wielder? Not much is recorded about them besides what's kept in the wielder temple. We know they were a massively creative person, and they changed the world in a major way. Before them, nobody had seen color before. Wow. That's wild to think about. From the stories we have, it seems like the brush sprouted here just for them. Who knows, maybe they were like, some kind of alien or god or something. Fak was the first wielder. Fak confirmed for alien. Haha, uh -huh. probably not. Okay. Wait, now what? How many wielders have they been? I'm actually curious about those. Well, hundreds. Not so exclusive, right? After the first wielder died, the brush just passed naturally from person to person. Oh, well, it's weird that now the wielder chooses the next wielder rather than the brush doing it. Or maybe the brush did choose us. But it was way too sought after. Wars were fought over it. Jeez. People died for it. We had to make rules for how and when it passed on. Rules that everyone agreed to so it could, be, so it could pass peacefully. 
guess that's how we wound up with all this. Wielder, apprentice, trial, crap. <gasps> they said crap. Worked though. People don't die over it these days. It's easy to forget how lucky we are. I wonder if wielders were more powerful back then. It's like Star Wars rules where in the prequels the force was like way stronger. There was like way more Jedi out there. And then by the original trilogy like it was way weaker. Where are your flowers at? Yup, most flowers here were planted by former wielders. I still remember which ones are mine. Exciting back then starting out. Well, where's your flowers at? Seeing this old tree and all the wilder flowers, I think it started to dawn on me the weight of all the artists whose legacy I carried. Wanting to be the best wasn't enough, so I had to be the best for all of them. A lot to carry. Alright, let's uh... It's really so important to pull this legacy. I don't know if I'm the right person to do that. Maybe I had a better off... I'd have been better off back then if I hadn't confronted this. I hate this legacy. These expectations. They took so much from me. And it never mattered anyway. You really don't have to be anything. You can be great your own way, Breakfast. Don't let a stupid legacy control you. I'm ready. Oh! You didn't have to fight a boss this time. Wow, so we're, we're on to the final chapter now. Those brush flowers you planted, that's where they'll stay now, forever. This is it, breakfast. You've completed all the wilder trials. What if I just go and uh, move them around? Your bond with the brush has weakened? Question mark. You now have full, full control over the brush. You've been completely corrupted. You can even swim up waterfalls. Ooh, that's new. You're finally strong enough to face the corruption on top of the Wilder Tower. How do you feel? Can you like try to face the corruption early on and you can't do it? I'm curious what happens. Unlimited power. I'm not so sure. I'm proud of you, Breakfast. All these corruptions should have been my problem alone and facing them all made me want to give up. But you stood up to everything. I'm so glad you're here. I really don't deserve you. But I'll be there to cheer for you. When you're ready. Come meet me in luncheon. Oh boy! That's my flower, and my flower, and my flower, and my flower. And the rest of you's flowers? I could give the hex. That's right. No one can compare to mine. Breakfast has gone mad with power. But I want to read this plaque. It's, it's unreadable. Oh, well. You learned the hmm for waterfall and can now reach the Pokemon League in Ever Grande City. What on earth are you talking about? Is that the right way? No, that's a present. Oh, no, that's not the right one either. Oh, wait, I can swim with waterfalls. That means I could go up this one that I couldn't go up before. Dooby dooby doo ba, scooby dooby doo ba. Oh, it's the last thing. Well, that's why I didn't see it, because I was you're not able to get it until after. Well, we could just leave it. We don't need to worry about no stinking flower. That would have been too easy. Oh. Um. There we go. A gift. A shawl. Good for the cold weather. For the cold weather. I am what? I am Sam I am. 
Would you like green eggs and ham? Wait, am I just supposed to jump from here? This is like lower there. Oh. Uh, you're able to get it be uh, before learning him for waterfall. What the heck is him? Oh, HM hidden machine techniques in Pokemon that your Pokemon can learn in the overworld. What the heck? Pokemon use use machines? Guess I could keep this one. Oh yeah, I know that him is the villain from Powerpuff. Don't get me wrong. Um, it doesn't look like there's any other path to come up the waterfall. So yeah, I don't know. Oh well. Whatever it was, I didn't see it. We would just come back this way, right? There we go. All right, fellas. We're ready for the big finale. You've surely played enough of at least one of the Pokemon games to encounter hymns. I, I don't, I don't know. I don't remember hymns in Pokemon Quartz, I just remember, um... Wait, is the adult the original wielder this entire time? Wasn't the original wielder like an ant or something? Come here, Walter. No, Walter, don't go down there. Close this. No, you're not. Oh, Walter, please. Ah. Ah. Ah, uh, take this treat and go be good or something. Ah, uh, Walter. <laughs> okay. Well, at least lunch in town's thriving since we've been gone. Oh, it's you. I was just going about my regular adult travels, but... Why is this place so creepy? Everyone says you're gonna stop it. Well, good luck. I'm gonna get the heck out of here myself. Breck. Wow, wow. It got so scary here. I can't believe you're really going to fight it. You're very brave, Breakfast. I was never such a good wielder. <laughs> Hope it goes okay. So did Cardamon uh, pass it on to Blackberry? Or was there some in between? Because it doesn't seem like they have much of a relationship, or at least they haven't brought each other up. Oh yeah, we're just going to do the ending, because we only have one chapter left anyway, so if we saved it for another stream, it would be probably a pretty short stream. More NPCs show up here the more side quests you do and people you help. They're all gone, what the heck? So there's a cup, there's a few in like different corners. Oh, she's back. What the heck? They left and then they came back. I'll talk to a few more people. It's you, the one who loves music. They say you're fighting on our behalf. What an inspiration. I'm just a bard. But I figured I could at least rouse you with a song. Is it the song we wrote? Yep. Uh, 
Yeah. Feeling roused yet? Didn't know being the wielder could be so scary. I don't think I could do it. Uh, I just really like drawing. Hope you don't mess up an awk and cause us to die. Or anything like that. No, I wrote that song, Feck. We, we, uh, we did it earlier. You weren't here. Breakfast, thank goodness you're here. Is it true that you're gonna face the corruption? I hope you could fix it. I can't function like this anymore. You're special to me, Lemon. You were the first person that I helped, even though you didn't really appreciate uh, how I painted your, your place. And this is my biggest fan. I'm rooting for you. You're my hero, Breakfast. No, 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 I caught that, uh, fact. I did catch that. One second. Okay, let's go face that great evil now. Wow, even Chikori's here. The end is just ahead. All those trials, all our preparation. Don't call it the end, that sounds a little foreboding. It's all come down to this. So, you feel ready? So ready. Bring it on, giant scary corruption. Well, before you go, we've got to talk about what's gonna happen after. I've been giving it a lot of thought and I think we should destroy the brush. What? The brush connects with the worst parts of us and makes them real. It lets us make beautiful things, but it's also carrying the darkness of every past wielder. And at this point, it's a threat to everyone in Picnic. That thing is evil. I don't know, I think it's just... You know, it's... It, it's like... It's all, like you said, it's the dark within the people themselves, but if we can confront that and pacify it, I think we'll be okay. Would you say there's a darkness imprisoning me? Destroying it is the right thing to do. What do you think? Yeah, this fight could fix it, we don't know. Let's at least give it a chance. Every single wielder has fought corruptions, but it still has our imprints in it. If fighting back actually fixed it, then we wouldn't be in this situation. I don't agree. I think this is an unprecedented uh, moment. Maybe the problem will seem to go away for a bit, but then it'll come back. Yeah, and then the next wielder will take care of it once in a while. You know, it's like... That's like saying, Why should we take a shower? We're just gonna get smelly again. Yeah, just gotta take a shower once in a while. Probably even worse. That's why I wanted to bring this up now. It tricks us into thinking everything's okay. But it's the root of all corruptions. And I bet the only way to get rid of them is to annihilate the source. What do you think? They're gonna make us land on we should destroy it, isn't it? Because none of these other ones are going to be any better of an argument. Everything would go black and white again and there'd be no way to... F to 
put it back. I'm not stoked about that either, but if we keep it around, people will get really hurt because of it. We have to decide if it's worth the risk. Would it be so bad to stay black and white if it meant everyone was safe? Yes. It's been around so long. Exactly, proper lawn care. Who cares how long it's been around? That doesn't make it any less evil. It just means we've been more trained to accept it without questioning why. Screw that. That's not a way to make decisions. If it's hurting us, we should question why it's here. And it's not just that. After everything the brush has done to me, I want it gone. I don't know. I don't I feel like the wielders aren't in a good headspace. So why do they think destroying the brush will automatically fix it? I feel like that's something you need to work on within yourself. You can't attribute all the problems to you know this other uh object i feel like that's this is a deeper part within ourselves i still think we shouldn't subtext is overrated i prefer dom text switch text you guys are out of control it doesn't feel right, even if it is dangerous. Destroying it just can't be the right answer. Not long ago I'd have agreed with you, but I don't see another way now. You should be careful. Don't let that thing inside your head. You've still got a battle to get through. Good luck, breakfast. You're saying all this stuff about the brush getting in our head, but the only thing the brush has done is threaten us? Well, not really, but like the things that are supposedly came from the, the brush. The brush has never been like, don't destroy me. If anything, it's, give, it's given you a reason to destroy it. Actually, there's something I've been wanting to ask you. Oh, what is it? Um, never mind. I'll ask you afterward. I should focus on the battle for now. No, oh, that's too frustrating. Breakfast, what if you don't come back? I mean, yeah, you can just tell me after. I know you will. You got this. Everyone came to lunch and to cheer for you. I promise I'll make you proud. Seriously, you're gonna leave me hanging like that? What were you gonna ask? Sorry, it's just not a good time. Mm. Well, you better not forget what it was. I won't. I'd be the type to forget what it was. Thanks for all your help, Chick Chickory. I taught you everything I could and you've come so far and got so far, but in the end, doesn't really matter. Just one last push. Okay. Here we go. Whoa. So what happens if you try to come up here when you're not ready? Does it just not open up for you? I'm coloring. Ooh, that's the spookiest tree of all. Uh-oh, we can't even color color anymore, just gray. Which I guess is technically a color, but... We needed our fully powered brush to make our way here. But you know what? They may have taken away my color, but they can't take away my love. Okay, maybe they can. Um, hello, <laughs> yeah, hello. Wow, this place goes deep. Why is it so big in here? Big tree. See, all these trees are past wielders, don't you know? Oh, they're making funny faces. We're gonna turn into trees next. It's like the transdermal celebration music video. Ah, uh, I wish I wasn't so nervous. Everyone's counting on me, especially Chicory. I need to rise up to this. But. But. Ooh, did you see that? Depending on which direction you go, it's like. I wonder if it's like a endless maze thing, so you need to know to go 
right direction. Let's see. Okay. Right. So far, so good. Oh, but that wants us to go right, though. It's like. Let's see. No, maybe. Oh, I'm walking really slow now. It's like heavy. Why am I still so nervous talking to Chicory? I should have said something. But I guess I'm most worried about letting her down. She needs me to be ready for this. And I know the trials were supposed to make me a real wielder. But even after everything, I don't feel different at all. Maybe it's because I'm a fraud. <gasps> You're not. You're not real. No, I'm not. But it's still true. Can't smile as you say it. I've been afraid to ask her, but I need to know. Why did Chicory choose me to be the wielder? Because you stole the brush. That's <laughs> pretty obvious. Did she really think at the time it was a good idea? You're asking her shadow? You already know the answer, don't you? She didn't. I know she really didn't. Everything happened by accident. I just got the brush because I happened to be there. Part of me still hoped that I really was special, and I just hadn't figured out how yet. But breakfast, you are special. I know that's what she'd really say, but it feels just as real coming from you. Why? I thought all I ever wanted was for her to believe in me, but even if she does, I still feel like a nobody. It's because there's nothing you can do or anyone can say to change what you really are. No! No! Oh, they bit my brush! You don't deserve this brush. Never have, never will. Don't you think it's time you gave it back? Well, that's what Chicory wants, kind of. Be good, Walter. What the heck? Oh, you're awake. Is this a dream sequence? Breakfast, are you okay? Um, we aren't sure what happened. We found you outside the tower, passed out. You must have been through so much. I'm so sorry, sweetie. Can you walk? Oh, look, it's that, uh... Painting we did on the wall there. Oh good, I'm so glad you can at least move. Breakfast, we were all so worried for you. We have a little paw instead of our brush. Um, and well, we don't know where the brush is, do you? I think that's worrying everyone quite a bit too. It's... It's okay, sweetie. You don't need to say right now if you don't want to. Take your time and rest here. But when you're ready, maybe you should go back to luncheon. Everyone's looking for the brush there. Including Chicory. Might be good to speak with her. Thanks. I don't think this is real. Hey kiddo, uh, sorry about whatever happened. We all mess up sometimes, you know? It's okay though, promise. Your ma and I still love you no matter what. Aww. Hey buddy. Hey Clementine. You gonna be okay? I don't know. So sorry, breakfast. Maybe it was all too much. Totally up to you what you want to do, okay? If you want to stop now and let everyone else figure out what happens next, that's okay. You already gave so much. You know, even if we're not comfortable being, like, an artist or being the wielder, we did destroy, like, all those bosses, so... I think, um, breakfast needs to have more confidence. I love you, Breakfast. It's gonna be okay. I'm just glad you're still here. Believe me, your old man screwed up plenty of times. More times than I can remember. That's just part of life, right? No big deal. It's okay, Breakfast. Whatever happened, I know you did your best. We all know that. We've really been asking so much of you. Too much. Too much. The mom and dad have, like, different fonts. D does, um, express joy? Oh. Want to save a GIF? 
Uh, sure. Oh god! I forgot that it's like a... Outside the game thing. Okay. <laughs> We're great at paint-based ba violence, exactly. Does every character have a different font? I've only noticed, like, the right now that these do. I love you, Breakfast, no matter what, okay? You don't have to talk to me now. But when you're ready, you can. Maybe some fresh air will be nice. When we go out there, it's gonna be, uh... Oh no, it looks fine. Oh no, I can't use my paint powers to swim faster. Oh wait, I should use the bus. That was a close one. There's a note on the bench. It says, due to seemingly apocalyptic circumstances, we have to temporarily halt our transit services. Well, that's inconvenient. Darn it. Okay, so I need to get back to luncheon. And where am I at right now? Here. So I need to go... Hopefully that's the right path. There might be something that I need the brush for. Or maybe these colors are just going to lead me. I don't know exactly. Be good, Walter. Was this bridge always here? Oh no, see these trees are in the way. Because this is how I would usually go through with the brush. Oh, it's you. Oh, breakfast. I thought I might find you here. Everyone's looking for the brush, but well, I was just getting in the way. So I came to check on you instead. You don't have a way back to luncheon, do you? I can help. Meet me on one screen left and two down from here. Okay. Could have just followed you, but all right. Does Walter have knowledge of good and evil? Oh, he knows when he's being bad. Don't let his like seemingly oblivious expression tell you otherwise. You made it. Well, here goes. Am I gonna swim on you like uh? I'm actually a fairly adept swimmer. I could take you across the river here if you want. I sure do want. We look so sad. This is just that story. What is it? The Is it a fox and a mouse? It's a fox and a son or a wolf and a mouse. That's you know the story, right? Where they're swimming across the water and they're like Oh, the water's getting deeper. You have to move up to my back. Oh, it's getting really deep. You got to move up to my head. And they're really, they're just tricking the poor thing. Walterian mor morality? No. Walter, you be a good boy this thing. You already got your treat. Oh no, the scorpion stinging the frog is a whole different thing, but I, I it, it, it starts off similarly. You can head up uh, from here to get to luncheon. I hope I was helpful. Usually I just feel like an annoyance. But I really appreciate what you've done, Breakfast. I think everyone does. We all know you did your best. Everyone was just hoping you'd come back all right. Well, I'll be here. You're you're great, Lemon. You were the first person I helped, and you helped me. I know it's never been easy for you, but the fact that you keep trying anyway, it inspires me. I want to learn to do that too. For, for someone called Lemon, you're not sour at all. Well, hang on, I want to go down first just to see if there's anything. Uh... Okay, I'm just gonna... Well, I don't know, actually, because why would this bridge be here? There might be some down here. Let's keep going for a bit. Secret house. 
Hello, secret house. Oh, you're that wielder, ain't ya? I heard stuff went south. Sorry to hear it. Guess we're all figuring out what happens next now. Good luck with everything. Wait. Question mark? Hey, don't touch that. It hides an old family secret. Something that opens the way to treasure. Wait, I shouldn't say that. Probably makes you want to see it even more. Well, you shouldn't. No peeking. Aw. Maybe later. What's funny that I just happen to not never go this way, and then this is like one of the only ways I can go right now without the brush. Well, directly from like the main path home. Oh no, there's a cat there, but I can't save it. We're powerless. Thank goodness you're okay. We can't find the brush anywhere. There's such a strange lingering feeling like something fundamental has broken. It's hard to describe. But well, you must be worried enough as it is. We're here for you, breakfast. Hey, I came out here looking for the brush. Although, to be honest, I was pretty sure it wasn't actually here. Just wanted to get out of luncheon. Real hecked up in there. Are you going back in? Yowza, you do you, I guess. Ah, hey. Are you doing alright? You don't look so good. Well, nothing looks good right about now. It kind of feels like we all might die. Well, um, but sorry about whatever happened. We're all just doing our best, you know? Hope things get better. I genuinely do. Poor Pickle never got to try the brush out. Now it's gone forever. Alright, I'm not going to stop talking to everyone. I think we're going to go ahead and, uh... The heck, since when was that fence there? That's sus. I thought Walter was being bad again, but he was just snoring that time. There's Chicory. Hello. Hey. I'm so sorry, Trickery. I messed everything up. The brush, it's gone. There's no way to fix this anymore. It's okay. I mean, no, it's not, but I'm glad you're okay, at least. Can I ask you something? Back when you first gave me the brush, did you really think it was a good idea? Did you really choose me? Of course not. This is obvious. Come on. You were just in the right place at the right time. You were just a janitor. But then she's gonna say, I realized that you were the right choice. I just wanted to be free of it. The pressure, I mean. But also, the whole institution having to choose, having to answer to the legacy of old dead artists, having to do or be anything. I needed to knock all that stuff down for myself. So you resented that legacy. Did you choose me because I was a bad choice? Is that all I mean to you? When I said you could take the brush, you were already holding it. You had already taken it and colored, and faced the corruption and made it back. You are a living example that you don't have to be chosen to be capable. Exactly. You showed me a possibility I hadn't considered, and you've only come farther since then. You shouldn't need to hear why you deserved it. You already proved it yourself a million times, but maybe you're missing the most important thing. What's that? The brush. Just kidding. Actually wanting it. I know you wanted to do it for me. But was it something you wanted for yourself? I never even asked, just forced it onto you. So I'm asking now, do you want the brush? Or sorry, did you want the brush? Good question. I did. I, I really, really did. I've always wanted to make a mark on the world. I want to be someone great like that, but I never felt like I was ready. You were the first person to ever give me the chance. And I, I let it slip through my fingers. I feel so horrible. But I wanted it. Now that it's gone, it's like a part of me is missing. I can almost feel it. Like it's still there, right? I remember that. After being so connected to it, like I couldn't get rid of it completely. No, it... It really feels like it's still there. Like I could just... <gasps> da -da 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 -da. Try drawing just one more time. Drawing. 
drawing. Try calling. This is epic. Dude, we're, we're using our telekinetic brush plant powers to summon an even more powerful brush. Because Chicory loves brushes. We're making a new tree for all to see. Am I supposed to be like doing something in particular? Trigger is looking at me. She doesn't even notice the giant uh, brush plant popping up behind us. It's a new brush. My brush. Maybe every wielder should have their own brush. That's the real lesson here. You made a brand new brush? What the heck? How did you... That's possible? I remembered how it felt and I guess that it br brought it back. That's not the same brush. That's your brush. Yeah, maybe that's why we sh shouldn't be passing on the same brush that keeps taking on more and more of uh, the weight of all the different artists <laughs> throughout the years. That, maybe that's the problem. Maybe for the first wielder it was kind of the same. I knew what I wanted and how it felt. Like a muscle I'd never known to use before. But once I did it was there. That's incredible. Does this mean I could try again? I can face that corruption one more time and I can still make everything right. I can do it. Breakfast. Yeah, you can do it. Go and show them. Can't believe it's real. Just like the one in the rainforest. I never even considered you could make another. When did you get so... It was actually kind of good that that's the last one we did because it played right into this moment. Like it was really fresh in our heads that we just visited the paintbrush uh, trial and then that happened. I thought I was supposed to be the teacher, haha. <laughs> I feel so left behind. When things got hard for me, I just gave up, but you picked back up and kept going. I should be the one looking up to you breakfast. I don't know if that's really fair to you, but you definitely shouldn't look up to me. I still don't really know what I'm doing. After everything we've been through, I have have I left the impression that I do either? If someone thinks they know what they're doing, you should honestly probably avoid them, huh? When I trained to be a wielder, all I was told and all I was thought about what was what wasn't allowed or possible. But you don't fit the wielder model at all. You're someone who's changing all the rules as you go, and I think it's about time they change too. You got this. If that huge corruption took the brush, and I bet it's still in there. It knew we were planning to destroy it. So it's probably hiding, consolidating its power. But it might not be ready to fight another brush. That's the only shot we got now. You've already done a million things nobody thought possible, so I think you can do it. Good luck, breakfast. I'm going to leave. Uh-oh. Oh, I thought I softlocked the can for a second. Okay. I was like auto running. I want to look at the portraits real quick. Oh gosh, I forgot I defaced everything out of anger. The first one was a giraffe. I thought they said that my picture was hanging up in here now. Oh. Oh! <laughs> well, um... Oh, this confirms that the uh, the lion dude, Cardamom, did pass the brush on to Blackberry, because that's that's how the uh, the lineage seems to go down to. Okay, this artist makes me feel a little better. Look at this one, the stick figure mouse. So I guess you don't have to be an amazing artist to be a wielder.
Oh, that was nice of her to hang that up. All right, let's let's do this for real this time. I'm ready. Jedi's gotta do what a Jedi's gotta do. So now, Vader, I'm coming for you. What the? Take a nap. Yo, you'll send me your your self portrait. Oh, interesting. Is it a little bit better than mine? Whoa, blurry. That's actually a really unsettling effect. Get into creepypasta mode. Was I supposed to recognize those other uh, rooms? One of them was probably my bedroom, I'm guessing. Low quality eyeballs are coming for us. Oh man, the brush has wings. Ow! Oh no, not this again, like that first boss. This song is like a friggin' prog rock band from like the 70s. 60s, 70s. Because of those, uh, those keys, that organ -y. Oh no, I clicked off the game. I wonder why you're able to do that. It feels like it doesn't restrict your mouse, I guess. Hang on, before I make sure this is... Sorry, my uh, OBS was covered up, so I wasn't sure if I was muted or not. Just wanted to make sure. Damn it. So when I say I click off the game, it's like it, the, the game litter screen is literally minimizes. Um, like if if I get my cursor off the screen, it's like as if it's not properly full screen. I just did it again. I think I just moved something too. Hang on. Yeah, let me see if I could fix that actually. See, it's on yeah, but I don't think there's a option to, it is borderless, I will say that. Um, okay, it's fine, we'll just try to avoid doing that. Oh right, this is the mirror match. Oh, I was trying to hit myself, I'm a dummy. Wait, is this not the mirror match? No, it is the mirror match. I just... Okay, I got it. It's still mirrored match. This... I don't think it is this time. fall off the brush, that's when we start We're matching it up. Okay. 
Oh, god damn it! What did I just tell myself? Yeah, it's probably a multi-monitor issue. That that makes sense. I mean, it wouldn't be an issue if it wasn't for the mo the extra monitor, but it, I kind of need that for streaming. It really uh, it's streaming without is it is is a uh, especially uh, tricky. Uh oh, Ugh. You Can't do this to me. I can't do anything. <gasps> Chicory made her own brush as well. Breakfast. I owe you a pretty big thank you. Cause after seeing you make one of these, I realize I could too. That's a huge brush, by the way. Turns out there's a lot I can do that I didn't think possible. I'm tired of feeling afraid and useless. I'm here for you this time. Let's take this thing down together. Yeah. Ah. Oh good, I didn't die. I do wonder if like that's where you would game over if you could game over, but maybe you you just can't. The doppelganger. There we go. Oh, you missed. I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing something here, or you just wait until she actually gets hit. Okay, so the gray spots are safe, it's just the new... The newer gray spots that are not safe. I think the only thing about these fights is sometimes it's a little tricky for me to tell like what the hazard is. Or to distinguish the hazard from like just a remnant of a hazard. Pretty cool though, otherwise. Yes! Stop. There's like a like per second you do. There's probably a limit. A remnant from the ashes, yeah. Could be. Oh! I didn't realize what was going on there. Oh jeez, I was looking at the chat like a dummy. Jake, get out of that spot? Oh, you just jumped. Why don't I think to jump ever? That's some good thinking. <gasps> oh! Oh! Up, duck, hat, what? Up, the hip, up, up, kangaroo, up, up, this, up, 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 up,
Yeah, it's reverting all the way back to its original form. It's gonna come at us with every wielder through all of history. No big deal, right? If you believe in me, Chicory, well, even if you don't. Even if you don't, I think we're gonna do it. The original form is a tree, of course. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh. This feels like it's probably like an endurance round situation. Oh! This is probably starting to feel like a delta rune or something. These objects. Hope to avoid. Oh jeez. The orange is safe, because that's chicories. Now, I'm curious, if you pick orange as your favorite color, do they give chicory a different color? We only get some hits on it. Try to jump over it. I was kind of backed up into a corner there. You actually use your favorite color for every battle. Um, I think that, that I think. Yay! We beat the stick. We beat it. Whoa, it's raining color. Is it gonna color everything in? Or is that just for effect? Oh, oh wow, that was a very abrupt uh, credits. I assume there's gonna be like a post credit thing though. With the help of our lead artist, you. Well, that's cute. Lead colorist. I can't believe we actually did it. The brush is gone. Forever. Um... Now that we've actually done it, do you think it's okay? This seems like kind of a big deal. That thing wasn't so sp- Wait, now the, the new rule is instead of one wielder, there's always two wielders. The wielder master and the wielder apprentice. And the wielder apprentice is destined to take out the wielder master and become the next wielder master. This sounds right, right? Yeah, this sounds accurate. It's the rule of two. Wow. If we both made new brushes, then I bet anyone can. Just have to teach them. Color could be free. I think whatever happens next is good. But it's not going to be easy to teach. I barely even know how I grew a brush myself. Oh, her like shawl, shawl or whatever that was is gone. I could help you. But maybe not right now. I need a break. Yeah, I hear that. Let's just enjoy this for today. 
and tomorrow we change everything. And then they kept it a secret forever, and they and they instituted the new rule of two into the Wilder Society. Are those plants okay? Seem like they're kind of freaking out a little bit. Tomorrow, Pinky, we take over the world. Standing on the mountain top. Oh, this is the song that I I was gonna ask you guys what that song was about. Since I missed it. This is a time lapse of the colors. Some of the chords in like some of these songs, like the chord progressions give me like a, like a Saharan, like deserty, like, like a, like an Egyptian desert vibe, which I dig. I don't know exactly what the uh, term for it is. Oh, the main vocalist for the Near Game sings this. That's interesting. What if Blackberry just ran up and pushed Chicory into the water and then ran? Oh, look at all these Kickstarter backers. Is there anyone here I would recognize? Dragnix, maybe? I think I, I missed the dra section, so. So if he was, because I know he loved Wander's song, so I wouldn't have be surprised if he helped kickstart this. I'd have to get to go back and check it out. Right as I was saying it, he, he popped up. Oh, that's unfortunate that uh, you weren't able to. If you had those Z names, you would you would have got lucky with that smaller page. Goomba. Production pets. Dorito unofficial. What the? Oh look, they're in the water. They're in the lemonade water. That's a little weird because some of it's not yellow, so the yellow spots makes you think, like, maybe we shouldn't be in these yellow spots. 
Maybe not a great color for that spot. Wow, all the color that we did. I think my best work was at the top there in that, that uh, rooftop party. It's the only thing that looks like anything. Wow, there was like a lot of spots we didn't end up going to. I'm surprised that uh, there was that many we didn't fill in. Has anyone ever filled in like every single spot in the world with color? Because like looking at this, like even the spots I did color and they're not even colored in all the way. I feel like that'd be... You don't think that'd be hard to do? I mean, I, it looks like it would be, but you probably get an achievement for that. Oh, look, 70.29%. That's just barely a passing grade. I'll take it. We passed. Minus the places where the bugs eat the color. Well, those are in caves, I think, so I don't think those show up on the map, right? They were smart about that. I never found the fill tool brush style. Hmm. No, I don't. I've learned my my lesson with that. Well, we did it. We beated the chicory. It was a fun game. It was a, a nice heartwarming story. Um, you know, I still don't know if it's exactly like, like, uh, compatible with me. I was still kind of dumb about a lot of it, but it was fun. And I do want to do Wander Song again at some point, since I only ever did like the one stream on it, I think. Um, but yeah, that's, that is going to be it for this. I'll have to figure out what I'm going to play next since I beat uh, Pac-Man as well. And then the next poll... Uh, in a week, we'll have another poll, the second chance poll. This, this is a pretty cool game overall. I keep trying to think of like, what's the next game that I'm really looking forward to actually? Um, RE4 Remake I'll play on release, but I'm being cautious about how much I'm actually going to enjoy it. I feel like there's a chance with Capcom it could really... If only there was someone in chat subliminally... trying to subliminally sway you towards one game. Well, I'll probably play more games than the one that wins the next poll too, so... There's a good chance a lot, like, most of the suggestions will get played still. Um, Hotel Barcelona, I'm looking forward to that. And I probably think it's a good idea that it'll be a lower budget title because... While the idea of Suda and Swery working on a game together is awesome, it's also like really risky. I don't know how that's exactly going to turn out. It should be interesting, if anything. I also forgot that uh, the guy, I forget his name, the guy who directed the first Silent Hill, and he did some other games, including like Siren and something else. They actually asked him to work on it with them as well, back when they were first coming up with the idea. And apparently he told them yes. I don't know if he actually is, because he would have to be free, obviously. Uh, Itoi, maybe, let me, let me just look that up, so, 
to get that right. Um, no, it's Keichiro Toyama. Because he he only directed the first Silent Hill. He didn't do he didn't direct any of the other ones, but he also did Gravity Rush and Forbidden Siren. I guess which are games I don't know nothing about. So that makes me even more interested because I just happened to place the first Silent Hill and I liked it a lot. So I'm interested. Do you know what Gravity Rush is? Apparently, fact attention is now also grabbed. Yeah, apparently the director of Gravity Rush is going to be involved with it as well. Anyway, I'm going to wrap up now. Thank you guys all for joining. I will see all of you again soon, probably tomorrow. Y'all have a great night. Peace out.